I'm Ashley Allen here in the Nesson newsroom with Nesson.com soccer editor Marcus Samard. So Marcus, FIFA is facing its greatest crisis in history and with all the arrests and accusations it's been really difficult to follow. What's the latest on this? Well yeah, yesterday, uh, Wednesday was the darkest day in FIFA's history and there were emergency meetings yesterday and today and all of a sudden it was business as usual. Uh, FIFA's annual congress opened in Zurich, Sepp Blatter spoke, delivered the opening address, deflected blame to individual, a tiny minority of bad actors, and the presidential election will go ahead as scheduled on Friday. And how will this whole mess affect American soccer? Well, I, I wrote yesterday that it's really a story of lost money. Uh, bad ap actors were skimming from the top and the bottom. Uh, the dollar figure amount was 150 million. I expect that to rise to over 300 million when all is said and done. That's money that could have been used to help develop players and coaches, um, help you know enhance teams at all levels, and it's really lost. Uh, U.S. soccer is in a good moment now, but when you look at the last 25 years, what they could have done with all those resources, uh, it's lost opportunity. All right, Marcus, well, thank you so much for being with us. For everything soccer-related, Marcus Omard is your guy. And for all your sports news and updates, keep it at Nesson.com.